Ain't no way. Ain't no way we got this. Yo, this is what we needed. This is exactly what we needed. Crit rate, crit damage, come on. This is the piece. Synthesize is actually saving us here. 15 instantly. Come on. Come on. You know what? I'm not even surprised at this point. Like, this is this is a certified Honkai Starville moment right here. I'm growing depressed. Did I ever tell you what the definition of insanity is? Insanity is doing the exact same thing over and over again, expecting oh, shit. shit to change. That is crazy. Over and over and over and over and over again, thinking this time it's going to be different. All right, so for the last few weeks, I've been spending every single stamina that I have on this cavern. What I mean is I've been living here for two weeks like a goblin, and I've been farming for the Ash Blazing Duke. Why? Let me tell you. This is currently the best best in slot for Himeko because of the follow-up damage and the high stackable attack that uh, she can easily get from her follow-up attacks. And because of that, I really like Himeko. I want to build her. I want the four-piece set. Let's spend everything that we have. In general, I think I spent around 3000 stamina over the course of the last two weeks. And hopefully we can also get some off pieces for both Topaz and Clara because they also benefit a lot from the follow-up attack. But yeah, currently this is the Himeko that I'm using, really high attack, crit rate 55%. It's really hard to get crit rate on Himeko. The only thing that she also has when it comes to crit rate is the 15% when she's above 80% HP. So effectively she has 70% crit rate, which is decent, but I would open want to have above 60%. If I have like 65%, that's 80% crit rate, which is really nice. The relics are not bad, but I'm lacking a lot of crit rate, crit damage, and everything always goes into attack. But yeah, crit damage with no crit rate here on the chest is also really, really sad. But it is what it is, you know. Sometimes you have to work with what you have. I'm running Salsoto, as you all know it, crit rate and just the ultimate and follow-up damage, really great. Always recommend using it, fire damage boost, just the usual stuff that every guide out there recommends it. And that is my Himeko. But now it's time for us to check out the inventory and see if we got any big hits in the last two weeks. Hopefully we can make a pretty decent Himeko if the Relic, Luck and the Gods are on our side today. Also look at the amount of the purple boys that I have. Yo, the purple boys are gonna come in clutch. We are gonna salvage all of this. So yeah, let's get to that first. Let's see, how much can we get? Select all 514 for salvage. Good enough if you ask me. I'm just gonna go through them like this salvaging process. Like with every... Ah, oh, this is so bad. HP. Attack with crit damage. Maybe it has potential. Nah. Ah. Uh, nah. I, I don't lock it. Attack with crit damage and speed. Not bad. Man, with every click that I do here, just a part of my soul dies man look at this hp look at the substats speed crit rate crit damage yo do i i'm gonna lock it just for you know <laughs> the substats look nice attack nah hp 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 Ooh, wait this is good speed crit rate crit damage effect resistance oh this can be really good really really good i have hope Oh, crit damage with crit rate, okay. Another crit damage chest piece. Crit damage chest pieces are really rare, so... HP, crit rate, attack, attack. Ooh, crit rate with crit damage. Okay, I'm gonna lock it. It has potential, it has a lot of potential as an off piece for future. Okay, let's start uh, leveling some relics, because this is where all our hopes and dreams go and evaporate in a matter of seconds. Let's start with this one. HP crit damage. Break effect, come on. I believe. Wait. Crit rate 9%! Wait, wait, wait. This proc... Nothing went into crit damage. No. Break effect. HP. Yo, it proc'd crit rate. But no crit damage. Imagine if this thing went into crit damage. Okay, wait. But these are pretty good. These are nasty. These are actually nasty. As a first roll, this is good. This is good as a first roll. Do we have anything else? HP, speed. Okay, more attack boots. No. 
speed crit damage. What about this? Imagine. Imagine. Oh, looks like I didn't imagine enough. Next time I should uh, try better, right? Maybe not. Crit rate attack flat, HP flat. Ooh, copium. The biggest cope of them all. I wanna roll on this, please. Please. Come on, man. Come on. Just, just give me. Give me crit. Give me crit. Crit, crit, crit. Ain't no way. It completely missed all the crit. Yo, flat attack into all attack into HP. It didn't go a single dime into crit. This is HP a little bit less attack, but this is like 12% attack. Man, come on. If it only proc to one crit rate. I just asked one crit rate. But it's good. We need to be happy with this. Crit damage with crit rate. Okay, come on. Give me, give me a few crit rates, please. Hey, that is good. 8% crit rate. Oh my god, this defense though. It went a lot into defense, but not bad. 8% crit rate on a crit damage SP. I'm good with that. Honestly, I'm good. What else do we have? Do we have anything good? Maybe this one? Crit damage. Can it proc crit rate? Yeah, I'm wasting resources here. Okay, this is cursed. I need to delete this. I need to instantly delete this. I need to put this into another relic. This is so cursed. Hmm, maybe this, this, maybe, speed crit damage defense, yikes, I mean a little bit speed, but flat defense on this, I believe in this piece, come on, speed crit rate crit damage effect resistance, please, I believe, 15 instantly, oh my, wait, 12, 18, yo, this is 30 crit value, right, and it proc attack percentage, Let's go. You see, sometimes just going plus 15 instantly, you get everything you want. Yo, these are some decent speed boots. I'm probably not gonna use them on my Himeko, but I need attack boots. But for future, maybe if I'm not running Bronya. Oh, this is insane. Yo, speed boots with 30 crit value. Finally. Ain't no way. Ain't no way we got this. Yo, this is what we needed. This is exactly what we needed. Crit rate, crit damage, come on. This is the piece. Synthesize is actually saving us here. 15 instantly, come on. Come on. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this. Please, five more, five more. No, no. Crit damage attack. Crit rate, crit damage, and defense. It's the same piece. It is the same piece. There is no way. And we put this awful piece. And this piece as well. And a little bit of blues. And now we believe. Come on, man. Just just give me crit rate and crit damage. Crit rate, crit damage. Crit, 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 crit. Ooh. This is not bad. This is actually not bad. It went a lot into crit damage. It went a little bit into crit rate. It proc crit rate once only. It went into defense. But listen, this is way better than that copium piece. I don't even want to ever see that piece again in my inventory. I think it's time. It is actually time. Let me see. Let me see. Let's see. Where is the headpiece? So we have this headpiece. Which is 9% crit rate, some attack, effect hit rate. Yo, the gloves procced a giga strong. These are the gloves, not bad. This is pretty decent, this is almost 30 crit value. Good hands. Where is the chest piece? We got three chest pieces here today. Crit damage, crit rate 8%. Crit damage with this attack thing, and crit damage with some crit rate and speed. Honestly, I would just go more crit rate for now. 8% crit rate is pretty decent, especially for Himeko, right? I mean, I can probably go for this, but yeah. Like 5% crit rate is a lot, and I don't we are, we are gonna see how much this gives. Okay, let's equip this thing first. And where are my boots? We have the speed boots, and we have the attack boots. So these are the current ones. 9% crit rate, 18% crit damage. 
And these are the ones that we got today. 9% crit rate and 6% crit damage with some break effect. I'm gonna put the attack boots first. I mean, okay, let's put the best one that we have first. That is it. Four piece Duke. And these are the stats. 2700 attack, so we almost lost a thousand attack. Same crit rate, and we lost crit damage. Okay, I need to do this then. No, we, we go for this. We go definitely for this. Attack boots, and then we go for the chest piece. More crit rate, right? More crit rate, and this is decent. Let's see now. All in all, we didn't actually lose anything because the 500 attack that we kind of lost in pure stats, we are gonna have it uh, when we have like 8 stacks of Duke. Because 8 stacks of Duke... Every stack is 6% attack, and over the course of the battle, we are also gonna have way more follow-up damage. So Duke gives us 20% follow-up damage, Salsoto gives us another 15% follow-up damage. Yo, that's additionally 35% from follow-up damage when it comes to Kimeko's Pizza Cutter. Finally, 4 piece Duke, 3000 attack, 63% crit rate. So with 63%... That's a 78% crit rate with her traces. Damn, yo, Himeko is about to pump. But this was fun, this was fun. Like, just building a character today was fun on its own. Two weeks of spending all my time in that domain. We got some decent pieces. I mean, two weeks for building a full Himeko is pretty decent. Yo, I can't wait for Pure Fiction. This is gonna be fun. But yeah, I'm satisfied. I have a Grand Duke uh, four-piece Himeko now. Pure Fiction is approaching, and it was really fun just focusing on building one character for two weeks. 3,000 Trailblazer power used, but you know what? Himeko deserves it, okay? In the end, she deserves it. Anyways, thank you all for watching today. It was really fun, and as always, see you all in the next one.